Right, well, here's the men's start list. We'll worry about the, uh, the finalists in a little while for the women. So, Ivan Sevillier from France is up. He was a bronze medalist in the 200 metres time trial. Sixth in the 100 metre road. Danush Babu, be the outsider from India. Ricardo Christopher Verdugo Campos and Kuo Liang will probably be the favourite. The 18-year-old from... Chinese Taipei, Hui. That's the Indian Danush Babu. He was ninth in the 200 metres time trial and 11th in the 100 metres road race earlier. So it looks like we're going to get a yellow card here for the Indian. Number 38, there he is. Oh no, it's going to be chilly. Well, wow, isn't that interesting? Ricardo Christopher Verdugo Campos gets a yellow card. <laughs> well, make of that what you will. Chile receives the warning. And they're underway, and it's a really good start on the outside by Kuo Young. He will try to get a, establish a good position, but uh, at the moment it is the Indian who's made some great progress there. On the inside, Sevilla. Uh, Sevillier is uh, making headway, chasing down his Danush Babu. Babu off to the right here now, just waiting to pounce is Kuo Young from the Chinese Taipei. And Chile, at the moment, has, uh, well, come into second place. And I say Kuo Young has been left right at the back here at the moment. You can't be that far back and make any impression on the pack. Can they? It's coming up the hill. One little corner left here. And I don't think Hawley Young is so inexperienced he can make any difference. Here we go. This is the dash for the line. Pushing hard. Working hard. And it's a very, very impressive Ivan Silvillier. Ivan has done well. It looks like uh, Verdugo is in second place. Ricardo, second place. Sevillier from France. And uh, Chile's Ricardo Christopher in second place. But the times are very important here. Great uh, finish there from Sevillier. He's only 21 years old. Yeah, he started well. And just look at this. Those wheels are anything but helpful at the moment, but they are just push away time. Now this is when they come into their order. Great balance. Lovely, lovely flowing movement there, driving for the line. I have to say, Danush Babu did a great job coming in third. Right, Sevillier, 10616. That's outside the time that he performed in the previous uh, preliminaries, 10544. So maybe they're saving things to last. Isn't that the name of a song? Well, the USA will be very happy with this one because they've got an athlete involved, James Robert Sadler, on the right of uh, screen there. 108.29 for him in the preliminaries. He was ninth in the 100 metres road, 13th in the 200 time trial on track. He's only 20 years old. Simon Albrecht is uh, number 28 from Germany. He's next to Paraguay's Jose Daniel Moncada. Sick, um, series in 2017 in Poland. Duccio Marsili will probably be... He's not there at the minute. Well, he's in the blue. Track and then 500 metres, he was a silver medalist and bronze medalist in the 100 metres road. So when he came to the road yesterday, he was in contention, but only managed a bronze. So you'd expect this one lap of the road track to be in favour of Duccio Marsili, who's actually closest to us. Number 41. Here we go, then. I think they're away. They are. And immediately, it's Duccio Marsili from Italy who takes the lead. And he is in control. He wants to look at that there. That he said. He's going to move those uh, little uh, cones out of the way. He did it. 
because he felt that that centrifugal force was going to was push him way out over that curb there. His style is absolutely amazing, isn't it? Just look at that. He's shorter than the others, and he's making use of that uh, advantage, I would say. Look at him go. That's absolutely superb skating. Working hard with the left, even breaking there with both for this next drive into the bend. Excellent work. Simon Albrecht is in second place, but it's against the uh, clock. And it's a lovely movement from Duccio Marsili. He's actually gone all the way through and he's slowing up a little bit, if anything. Look at that. That's extraordinary. Marsili slowing up at 105.76. Albrecht was in second place. Wow, did that show confidence. We saw him at the beginning taking those cones away. And he, uh, he knew that he was going to go up on that curb. That just shows some planning and confidence. Although he's shaking his head, I'm not certain what about because it looked to be a fantastic start. Look at this. Those red wheels really not in use. And he's making... This is the moment when he goes right outside the course and across the curb. He allows himself to go wide and then over the top. Look at that. It is, it, this is a planned move. Fantastic. Albrecht has to lift his uh, right leg to get through. And in the end, it was a super performance from Duccio Massili. Look at this. 20 meters to go, and he's just looking behind him. And uh, he knows he's absolutely obliterated the opposition there in this second uh, heat of the semifinals. There you go. 105.76. Albrecht in second place. Moncada Silva in third. And Sadler from the U.S. five seconds behind the leader. 